Hey people, Hi. it's lobby time and today we're eating something special. What's that? Jeff's bagel run. Yes, bagels. 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 We have bagels in there. So if you don't know, Jeff's Bagel Run is a family owned business here in the Winter Garden Horizons West area that is uh, it's the bee's knees. It's what <laughs> everyone's talking about right now. If you want bagels just north of Walt Disney World property, then you're hoping you can get some from Jeff's Bagel Run. Yes, but you have to put in your order way in advance, and you're very lucky if you get it. A lot of the times, as soon as this bagel run drops, it's sold out in like one minute. Yeah, it's like very, very quick to the point that I think I got our order that we put in for our first time ever. Like I was right on it and then I think I checked a minute later and it was sold out. So yeah. that's how fast it goes. And like Didn't you have to put it in like two weeks ahead of time too? It was basically two weeks for us. So every Sunday reservations go on uh go on sale that you can pick up and then basically it kind of varies on which days he's going to be making bagels for, but like I just checked for the latest round of reservations and they were making bagels for Sunday. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, so a couple times a week, and in our circumstance, we got it for a Saturday, so basically, yeah, it was two weeks from the day we placed our order until the day we actually got to pick up our bagels, and there's lots of different options. You basically choose if you, you choose what day you want, and then you choose if you want either six or 12, and then you're allowed to mix them around with all of the flavors, and the flavors are plain, Everything, cinnamon raisin, Asiago, Asiago everything, oh. salt, sesame, poppy, onion, and garlic. And so, yeah, you get to choose around with what you want from it. You then, if you live in the zip code where Jeff's Bagel Run exists, then you can get delivery if your order is over $17. But for everyone else, you have to drive to Jeff's house and actually pick them up. And I was going to show the experience of it, but something about that felt weird because he's... It's his house. Yeah, it's his house. His family is there. You don't yeah. want to show that off. But at the same time, it's, you know, if, you, if you're if you lucky enough to get the bagels, then maybe, maybe you'll have it. Well, no, you won't get to see it anyways. But <laughs> yeah, it's, it's a crazy process. We went with the six pack of bagels. Yes. And what did we get? So we got two Asiago, two salt, uh, garlic, and an onion. The two salt and one Asiago was for him. The variety was for me. Yes, and uh, I'm not going to lie. We have gone through our bagels pretty quickly to the point that we are down to just one salt and a garlic left. Yeah. And uh, we've had it with cream cheese. We've mm -hmm. had them with uh, egg and cheese sandwiches. So and good. Yes, and so now we figured we'd save the last two to actually try on camera. Oh, so that means we need to go get the bagels, so... Star wipe. Look at those bagels all smeared up. So, of course, mine is the one that has more schmear because <laughs> I cannot limit the amount of cream cheese that I put on anything. No, you can't, but that's you, okay. Yours is light, but you also want to taste the garlic. Yeah, so. that's an, an important aspect of this. Okay, do you want to take your bite first? And I'll talk so that way we don't have to have awkward chewing silence. <laughs> I know you don't like that, <laughs> even though we put the lobby time theme over it and it's all romantic and gentle, but these are uh, New York style hand rolled bagels. So no two actually do look the same, which I appreciate about that and uh, and boiled and goes through all of that. So basically Jeff made them because he couldn't find a, a good bagel on this side of town and just took it on his own hands to to make it himself, and do you think he did a good job? <laughs> what? Do I have cream cheese all over me? I've got cream cheese on me? On my nose? On my mustache? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I'm uh, not gonna lie too. I already ate my bagel butt. <laughs> Is that what they call it? The bagel butt? Yeah, I ate the bagel butt. I couldn't wait. So it's, uh, you know, it's, it's hard. It's hard doing these kind of shoots. They take so long that Sometimes you just gotta dive in, so. Mm. And then I have a mustache, so it's also a lot harder I know, to hide. It's really, it was just like one little spot and I, 
I caught it on the corner of my eye and I was like, oh. Cool. Cool, cool. Cool, cool. cool. So. So. What? That is so garlicky. It's really, really good. It's really garlicky? Yeah. No vampires. Or vampires. 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 <laughs> okay, no vampires are coming around here today. I love the salt one. I, you know, a salt bagel is very, you know, it's more, it's not as plain as plain, but it still is basically plain. But I love it. There is nothing better than a salt bagel when you're hungover. Like a, a nice salty bagel in a big cup of water. And that is the perfect hangover cure, in my opinion. Sure. So you've never tried it. I haven't. You should sometime. It's really good for your health. Okay. But I love these bagels. So uh, it's. You say bagels funny. I do say it. I say lots of stuff funny. <laughs> So I love it. It's bag bagels. 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 Bag bagels. Bagels. Bag I say it more with an e. Yeah. Like beg. Yeah, you say bagel. Bagel. You like bagel. So, so just the e and the a. Yeah. I love it. It's <laughs> funny. Bagel. <laughs> it's a bagel. So yeah, I love these bagels, and <laughs> for you get the six pack for ten dollars, which mm -hmm. is awesome, and then. Well, we didn't order the 12 pack, so I don't know how much those cost. I'm assuming they cost more than $17, and that's how you get your free delivery if you live <laughs> in our zip code area. But this will not be the last time that we have these bagels. <laughs> For sure. For sure. And uh, yeah, if you if you live around here and you're lucky enough to uh, to pick them up, Please let us know what you think. And if you, for some reason, you're coming down here on vacation and you also have a rental car and you want to snag them, let us know what you think, too. Yeah. Everyone, just share your thoughts, your feelings, uh, your criticisms about how I say bagel. I would love to see it. So Bagel. My, uh, I'm going to start saying it because I've like picked on you about it. So now I'm going to be like, oh, that's a bagel. It's a bagel. It's a bagel. I don't know. how. <laughs> it's a bagel. <laughs> it's a bagel. Leave me alone. Okay. That's it for this lobby time. If you enjoyed the video, please subscribe to us. If you haven't already yet, hit the bell so you get notified when we have new lobby times. Leave us comments, again, and criticisms on how I say bagel. Maybe and, I say it wrong. And no, you, you most likely say it right. <laughs> I'm sure it's a Western Pennsylvania thing that we Maybe. all just say bagels. I don't know. We always say lots of weird stuff. And uh, yeah, hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed this as well, too. So I think that's going to do it for this lobby time. Stay healthy.